Congratulations, Morgan. Oh, it's time for bed, everyone. But I'm not tired yet. <sighs> then why are you yawning? I'm not yawning. Not much anyway. Mm. <sighs> 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 okay, Tori, it's time for bed. That's funny. Where's Kevin? Kevin! Where are you? What's wrong? It's Kevin, my fluffy buddy. He should be on the pillow with my other toys, but he's gone. Oh, don't worry, Morgan. He'll be around somewhere. He's not. And I can't go to sleep without him. Let's look. He's not on the sofa. He's not under the sofa. Oh, he's lost. We're never going to find him. I'm sure we'll find your bunny tomorrow. Tomorrow? But I can't go to sleep without Kevin. What a quiet night, B1. Quiet and peaceful, B2. I want my fluffy bunny! Did you hear that, B1? Someone sounds upset at the Teddy's house. Hello, Amy. Bananas, what brings you here so late? Uh, we heard a noise. Is everything all right? No, Kevin is missing. Poor Kevin, that's terrible. Uh, who is Kevin? A pink fluffy bunny. And I can't go to sleep without him. This is even more serious than we thought, B2. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Detective Bananas time! Wait here, Teddies. Where are you going? To change into our special detective clothes. The Detective Bananas are on the case, Morgan. Just lead us to the scene of the crime. Kevin should be on my pillow, but he's not. Hmm. What do you think, Detective B2? Hmm. I think... He's definitely not on the pillow, Detective B1. So where is he? Don't worry, Morgan. We'll find Kevin for you. The Detective Bananas always get their bunny. Now, do you have a photo of the missing bunny? I think so. Here he is. Hmm, that's very odd, Detective B1. Kevin looks exactly like Morgan. That is Morgan, Detective B2. Kevin is the one with the floppy ears. Oh, silly me. So, does Kevin have any other friends? Well, he is friendly with Bruce. Ah, ah Bruce. Bruce. Can we talk to Bruce? If you want to. Here he is. Hello, Bruce. When did you last see Kevin? Hmm? He won't talk, Detective B1. Of course he won't talk, Bananas. He's a toy. <laughs> so he is. <laughs> bananas, we really don't think Kevin is in the house. Why not? Because Morgan was carrying Kevin around all day. So he could have left him anywhere in Cuddlestown. Aha! Then we know exactly how to find him. How? All we have to do is go everywhere that Morgan went. And we're sure to find the missing bunny. The Detective Bananas are on the case. We think it's funny, funny. This fluffy bunny, bunny, has disappeared without a trace. We have to find him and remind him to stay at home at Morgan's place. We think it's funny, funny. This fluffy bunny, bunny, has vanished into Don't you worry, we're going to hurry and bring him back to Morgan Bear. Bananas, don't you think you should 
ask Morgan where he went today? Otherwise, you'll end up looking everywhere in Cuddles Town. Sounds good to me, B2. So, Morgan, where was the first place you went today? We went to Rat's shop. I'm sure I left Kevin at Rat's shop. Then Rat's shop it is, Detective B1. Are you awake? Oh, I was just going to sleep. Sorry, Rat, but we're on an urgent case. Kevin is missing. That's terrible. Uh, who is Kevin? Morgan's fluffy bunny. His bunny? Morgan left him here this morning. And I can't get to sleep without him. We have to search the whole shop from top to bottom. Be careful with... Never mind. Sorry, Rat. Detective work can be messy. Uh, very messy, Detective B1. I don't think Kevin is here, Bananas. Neither do I. They could be right, Detective B1. But if he's not here, where is he? Where did you go next, Morgan? We went to Charlie's place. That's it. I'm sure I left Kevin at Charlie's place. Charlie's place it is, Detective B1. Oh, wait, Bananas. What about this mess? Oh, uh, sorry, Rat. Grab that broom, Detective B1. No problem, Detective B2. It's clean-up time. Oops. All right, I agree. Your detective work is far too important to waste time here. We're happy to stay and help. No, 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 no. Off you go. I insist. Thanks, Rat. Bye. Bye. Now, cheese and whiskers. So you think Morgan left a bunny here? A fluffy bunny called Kevin. And I can't go to sleep without him. I don't remember seeing him, but if you want to take a look... Thanks, Charlie. Can you see Kevin anywhere, Detective B2? No, Detective B1. Why don't we dust for paw prints? Good idea, Detective B2. What are you doing, Bananas? Looking for Kevin's paw prints. With our special paw print finding dust. Hmm, how does it work? Simple, Charlie. We just put some dust on our brush, like so. Then brush it over everything to see if Kevin's paw prints are anywhere. So we'll know if he's been here. Watch! <laughs> <coughs> Can you see any paw prints, Detective B1? I can't see anything at all, Detective B2. <coughs> <coughs> any sign of Kevin, Bananas? No, Morgan. Any sign of him over here, Teddies? No, Bananas. Oh, dear. So where did you go next, Morgan? Um, we just went home. <sighs> Poor Kevin. Where can he be? Don't worry, Morgan. We're sure to find him tomorrow. But what about tonight? How will I get to sleep without him? That's a problem, Detective B1. A big problem, Detective B2. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Detective B1? I think I am, Detective B2. It's bunny making time! Bunny making? We'll make you a new bunny to take to bed. A new bunny? But... That's brilliant, Bananas. I'll get some material. And I'll get the sewing kit. And we'll get some stuffing. And I'll, I'll go to my room. <sighs> huh? That's funny. Kevin! You were here all along. You naughty bunny. Wait till I tell the others. How's the bunny's head going, Teddies? Nearly finished. How's the bunny's body going, Bananas? Almost done. Bananas, look what I found. 
Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy sewing the bunny's tail on. Lulu, Amy, look! Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy making the new bunny's ears. Oh, well. Come on, Kevin. There. All done. He's perfect, Detective B1. And so cute and cuddly, Detective B2. What do you think, Morgan? Where is Morgan? I think he went to his room. Ta-da! Meet your new bunny, Morgan. Morgan? He's asleep. And look what he's cuddling. It's, it's Kevin, Kevin the Fluffy Bunny. He must have been in Morgan's bed all along. Well, Detective B1, that's another case solved. Thanks for your help, Bananas. Yes, thank you. No problem, Teddies. Actually, there is one problem, Detective B2. What's that, Detective B1? Morgan won't need this bunny now. So what will we do with it? I think I might have an idea, Detective B1. <sighs> good night, B1. Good night, B2. And, and good, good night, night, little bunny. Sweet dreams. Time to clean the house, B1. Then it's off to the beach, B2. I'll do the dusting. I'll pack things away. Putting books away. Putting toys away. Putting B2 away. Putting magazines away. Hello, B1. Hello, B2. How's the dusting? Almost done. <laughs> Two. Right, B2. Let's check that all our jobs are done. Dusting. Check. Toys put away. Check. That means there's only one thing left to do. Vacuum the floor. Ready for countdown, B2? Counting down, B1. Five, Five four, four, three, two, two one. Hold on, B1. I'm holding B2. Whew. Cleaning all done. Now it's beach time. You're growing so well, Sunflower. You're almost ready for the big day. Good morning, Morgan. Hi, Camembert. That's a very fine flower you have there. I grew it myself. I'm going to enter it in the Cuddlestown Flower Show. And I'm sure you'll win a prize. Perhaps even a ribbon. A ribbon? Wow! Morgan, you were supposed to do all your gardening jobs before we went to the beach. I'm doing them. You still haven't raked the leaves. Or weeded the weeds. Or picked the apples. You've been looking at your flower again. Can't I do my jobs later? Sorry, Morgan. Garden first, beach second. Would you like to come to the beach with us, Camembert? Another day, Lulu. Bernard's coming to paint my gate. Bye, all. Bye, Camembert. Bye, Morgan. i see you at the beach after you finish your jobs. Oh. Hello, Morgan. Lovely day for the beach. Well, not for me, it isn't. It's not? Why not? I have all these jobs to do and I can't go to the beach till they're done. Jobs? What jobs? Sweeping the leaves and weeding the weeds and picking the apples. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's helping Morgan time! We've had lots of practice tidying our house. Now we'll help you to tidy the garden. You will? Thanks, Bananas. Now, Morgan, where will we start? Morgan? He's not over here, B2. Or under here, B1. He's gone. Never mind, B1. Let's get this garden all neat and tidy. Then we can go to the beach too. Marvellous, Rat. 
It was very good of you to sell me this paint so cheaply. Oh, a pleasure, Bernard. I've been trying to get rid of that rubbish for years. I, I mean, it'll last for years. Excellent, Rat. Bye. Uh, bye, Bernard. Oh, happy painting. <laughs> First job, B1. Time to pick the apples, B2. But the apples are very high. How will we reach them? Excellent idea, B1. It was your idea too, B2. A little more this way. Now a little more that way. Just back a little. Ah! Oh! Shall we try another job, B2? Just what I was thinking, B1. Pulling out these weeds should be easy, B2. Very easy, B1. This gardening's trickier than I thought, B2. Much, much trickier, B1. Let's try another job. This is more like it, B2. Much more like it, B1. We'll have these leaves picked up in no time. Then it's off to the beach. More leaves? And they're falling faster than we can pick them up. How will we ever get this garden tidy? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's vacuum cleaner time! <laughs> Ready for countdown, B2? Counting down, B1. Five, four, three, two, one! Vacuum Cleaner is doing all our gardening jobs for us. What an excellent vacuum cleaner it is, B2. Look out, B1. Morgan's flower, B2. Turn it off. Oh. That was Morgan's favourite flower. What will we do, B2? We need an idea, B1. <laughs> and I have one. We can plant him a new flower. No time to lose, B1. To Rat's shop. There you are, bananas. One packet of seeds and one pot. Uh, Rat, this is not a pot. It's a hat. No, 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 bananas. You're just holding it the wrong way. There you are. A perfect pot if ever I saw one. Thanks, Rat. First we put in the dirt, B1. Putting in the dirt, B2. Now we plant the seed in the dirt. Seed planted, B2. Now we water with our watering can. And wait for the flower to grow. Has it grown yet, B1? Mm, can't see any flower, B2. Hurry up and grow, Seed. We want to go to the beach. Hello, Bananas. Whatever are you doing? Hello, Dolly. We're waiting for this seed to grow. But seeds take a long time, Bananas. They do? Days, weeks, sometimes even longer. Longer? But Morgan will be back from the beach before then. And he'll be very sad if his flower's not here. Sorry, Bananas. I better go. I'm taking this lunch to Bernard. He's painting Camembert's gate. Painting? Oh, yes. In lots of different colours. Hmm. Maybe if we can't grow a flower, we can paint a picture of one instead. Come on, Dolly. No time to lose. <laughs> Bernard! We need your help, Bernard. Always happy to help, Bananas. Oh, 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 what kind of help? Can we borrow some paint? Oh, I'd love to lend you some paint, Bananas, but I've not finished painting the gate yet. Then we'll help you. Right, B2? Right, B1. It's, it's painting time! time. <laughs> 
Thank you, Bernard, and thank you, Bananas. My new gate looks beautiful. There you are, Bananas. Take all the paint you want. Thanks, Bernard. Bye, Dolly. Bye, Camembert. Check out my sandcastle. Wow, it's a beauty, Morgan. See? Aren't you glad you did all your garden jobs so quickly? Now you've had time to build that wonderful sandcastle. Uh, I didn't exactly do the jobs all by myself. Whatever do you mean, Morgan? Well, you see... The wind! It's blowing our umbrella away! It looks like a storm's coming. It's time to go home. Look at how tidy the garden is. You really did a great job, Morgan. Where's my flower? I don't understand. It was here when I left. <gasps> look! Wow! And look over there, too. Even more wow! And look over there. They look so real. Hello, Hello teddies. teddies. They are real. Huh? Bananas? What's going on? Uh, we had a little accident. While we were tidying the garden. You were tidying the garden? Morgan? That's what I was trying to tell you. I didn't exactly do all the garden jobs. How many exactly did you do? Uh, not many at all. You didn't do any, did you? You ran away to the beach and left it all to the bananas. Oh, sorry, bananas. Saying sorry is fine, Morgan, but you should help the bananas just like they helped you. Oh, OK, then. I'll clean the house and tidy the garden all this month. And I'll tidy your garden too, bananas. Thanks, Morgan. That's really nice of you, Morgan. Oh, no. Our garden's getting all messy again. Let's worry about that later. The wind is blowing and a storm is coming. Why don't we all go inside for hot chocolate and munchy honey cakes? Yum! How's the dusting going, Morgan? Almost done. And I've packed the toys away and done the sweeping too. Good work. Here's your honey cake and uh, hot chocolate. Cheer up, Morgan. There's plenty of honey cakes for everyone. Oh, it's not that. It's too cold to go back to the beach now. That means no more fun today. Well, we've got paint and we've got paper. If it's too cold to build a sandcastle or plant a flower, we'll paint pictures of them instead. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear that, B1? I hear that, B2. That sounds like... Emergency! Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! Pardon, B1. Excuse me, B2. Emergency! Ah! Emergency! Emergency! Huh? Do you still hear it, B1? I don't still hear it, B2. How strange. Very strange. What is it? What happened? What was all that noise? It's a mystery. A big mystery. I hope it doesn't happen again. It was freaky. Time for breakfast, B2. A nice, quiet breakfast, B1. Just the birds singing sweetly. And the breeze blowing softly. Cheers. Cheers. Ah! Emergency! Emergency! No! Pardon, B2! Excuse me, B1! Emergency! Ah! Huh? Bananas! There's that noise again! And now it's stopped again! What's going on? Ah! We need to get to the bottom of this mystery noise mystery. 
But how? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Let's Ask Charlie time! A mystery noise, you say? A very loud mystery noise. Hmm. How loud exactly, Bananas? <laughs> Whee! Sorry, Charlie. Are you all right? Fine, thank you. This sounds like a mystery worth solving, and I think I've got just the thing. Let's see. Hmm, it's not my <laughs> my super bouncy bouncer ball, and it's not my ultimate expando tent. Here you are, bananas. Just what I was looking for. My latest invention, the mystery noise detector. A mystery noise detector? You can detect any mystery noise with this. It makes even the quietest noise sound very, very loud. Did you hear that, B2? I heard it, B1. With these mystery noise detectors, we'll find that mystery noise for sure. Now remember, Bananas, when you hear a mystery noise, just follow the arrow. It will lead you straight there. Thanks, Charlie. Good luck. Ready, B1? Ready, B2? Let's find that mystery noise! Banana detectives, banana detectives, we're on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives, whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history. Banana detectives, banana detectives, no case too hard to crack. Can you hear any mystery noises yet, B2? No mystery noises yet, B1. I wonder where our mystery noise has gone. It's a mystery, that's for sure. Did you hear that, B1? I heard it, B2. It's a different noise. What could it be? It sounds like cracking. And it sounds like crunching. Could it be a monster? If it is, I hope it's a friendly monster. Look, B2, the arrow's pointing to where the sound came from. Then let's go that way, B1. Shh. Can you still hear it, B2? No, everything seems to have gone quiet again. There, there it is. is. But where's the noise coming from, B2? It's coming from up in that tree. Should we take a closer look? I think we should. Look, B1, a nest of baby birds. That was the cracking and crunching noise. It was the sound of the baby birds coming out of their eggs. It's all right, Mother Bird. We don't want to hurt your babies. <laughs> That's one mystery noise mystery solved, B2. But it wasn't the same mystery noise that woke us up this morning, B1. Huh? Did you hear that, B1? I do hear it, B2. Another, Another mystery noise. noise. Look, B1, the arrow. It's pointing over there. Wait, B1. What if... What if this time it really is a monster? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's banana disguise time. Do you think we're safe, B1? You bet, B2. No monster will ever recognise us now. Listen, B2. I can hear it, B1. The noise is coming from the Teddy's house. Look, B2, in the window. It's a monster. <laughs> and it's after the Teddy's. Don't worry, Teddy's. We'll save you. Hmm. What colour will I use next? Why not?
Yellow for the flowers. Don't worry, Lulu. We'll save you. Look out, monster. What monster? <laughs> Stay back, monster. Leave our friend alone. I think we've done it, B2. I think we have, B1. You're safe now, Lulu. The monster's gone. There aren't any monsters here, Bananas. There aren't? But we heard them with our mystery noise detector. It hears every sound around. And we heard a strange scratching sound. Like monsters sharpening their claws. Or like pencils on paper. Pencils on paper? There it is. That's the sound. You see, it wasn't a monster at all. But we saw the monster in the window. And there he is now! There, Lulu. The cleaning's all done. Oh, hello, Bananas. That's no monster. That's Morgan. Now do you believe me? <sighs> oh, we found lots of mystery noises with our mystery noise detector. But not the mystery noise we wanted. Do you hear that, B2? I hear it, B1. It's the noise we're after. What is it, Bananas? We don't know. Where's it coming from? That way. Then let's go after it. Oh, stop, you silly thing. Stop! Stop! Finally. Good work, Cameron Bear. You found our mystery noise. There's no mystery about it. I bought it on sale at Rat's Shop. Rat's Shop? It's supposed to tell me when it's milking time, but the silly thing doesn't work properly. It keeps going off all the time. Oh, well, at least we've solved the mystery noise mystery, B2. I think we have, B1. But I, I need to know when it's milking time or there won't be any milk to drink in the morning. What? No milk. We have to have our milk. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's back to Charlie time! Can do, Bananas. The cuckoo clock's right here. Thanks, Charlie. But there's one little change we'd like you to make. Oh, thank you, Bananas. It's wonderful. Uh, what is it? It looks like a cuckoo clock to me. It used to be a cuckoo clock, Morgan. But now it's a milking time clock. A milking time clock? I've never heard of one of those. Well, a cuckoo clock goes cuckoo, cuckoo. And a milking time clock goes... Milking time! Milking time! Oh, thank you, Bananas. Now I'll never miss milking time again. Mystery noise! Mystery noise! There must be a mystery noise somewhere. Listen, did you hear that? Hear what? That! And it's coming from over there! Surprise! Surprise! Bananas! Was that you making that noise? If you mean this noise... Then it was us, Morgan. We've brought a present. From Camembert. Looks like fresh milk. It is fresh milk. It's the first milk Camembert made after we gave her the new milking time clock. And she wanted us to have it. Great! Fresh milk's the best. Much better than being deafened by mystery noises. And it's all thanks to Camembert. Thanks, Camembert! Cheers! Whoops, sorry, Morgan. That's okay. That's one mystery noise I'm always happy to hear. <laughs> what a beautiful day for a walk by the lake. So peaceful. So quiet. Bananas! Did you hear that, B2? I did, B1. There! You're going the wrong way! You don't want to be late, do you? Late for what, Morgan? 
for Topsy's Shake and Bake Party. Topsy's Shake and Bake Party? You haven't forgotten, have you? Um, I don't think so. Just remind us, Teddies. What is it again? It's a party where everyone shakes and does their favourite dance. And bakes. And makes their favourite pies. My dance is called the Teddy Bear Bounce. See? Bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. Ah. Ah. Morgan! Are you all right, Morgan? Fine, thanks. Here, Morgan. We can help you out. Look out for the slippery mud, B1. What's slippery? <laughs> Sorry, Bananas. Now I've made you even later. Not to worry, Morgan. Shake and bake time. Here we come. The first thing we need is something to bake. Something very, very tasty. Something from our very own garden. Hmm. Can you see anything, B2? Nothing, B1. None of our vegetables have grown yet. Oh, dear. What are we going to do? Let's think about it while we eat our apples. Apples? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's apple pie time! That should do it, B2. Right, B1. Here's the last one. You know, there's only one thing I like more than baking apples, B2. What's that, B1? Eating them, of course. Now that we have our apples... It's time to make our pie. So let's get cooking! Cooking, cooking, cooking There's no better fun So don't try looking Cooking, cooking, cooking With sugar and spice in your day When you cook, cook, cooking away Mmm, what's that delicious smell? It's coming from the banana's house. I'd better go and see. There, B2. Our apple pie is ready. It looks good, B1. And smells good, B2. Mm. But it's too hot to eat right now. So we'll leave it here to cool on the windowsill. Morning, bananas. Morning, Pedro. <laughs> Mmm, what a delicious looking pie. It's just baked. Apple pie, fresh from the oven. I love apple pie. It's my favourite. Can I please have a piece? Just a little one. Sorry, Pedro. You'll have to wait for Topsy's shake and bake party. Shake and bake party? You shake and do your favourite dance. And bake something tasty to share. And that's why we baked our apple pie. To share with our friends at the party. And you can have some there. Now we better go and practice our dance, B1. The banana split, B2. <laughs> oh, I think we need more practice, B1. Ooh, a lot more practice, B2. Then let's do it. Bye, Pedro. Oh, lovely, lovely pie. I'm sure it wouldn't hurt to take just one teensy, weensy, tiny piece. <laughs> Delicious. The best apple pie ever. Just maybe a teensy weensy bit more. <gasps> oh, there's no more. I, I've eaten it all. Great dancing, B1. Great dancing, B2. Oh no, the bananas. Shall we see if our pie is cool now, B1? Look. No, let's check it later. Phew. We still need some homemade lemonade for the party. That's right, B1. Let's pick some lemons. What have I done? What will my friends the bananas say? Oh, dear. Oh, my. I 
I know. I'll make them another pie. <laughs> but I'm too short. I'll never reach those apples high up in the tree. Oh, so I can never make an apple pie. Maybe I'll make another pie. A special Pedro pig pie. So juicy, B1. Just right for lemonade, B2. We'll soon be off to Topsy's shake and bake party. Here come the bananas. Oh, we can't wait to see the lovely pie you baked. It's an apple pie. Yum! <coughs> no time for pie just yet. First we need to do some exercise. Shaking! That's right. It's dance time. Hooray! Over to you, Charlie. Let the dancing begin. Look, everyone. It's the teddy bear triangle. It's going to fall. Watch how a real dancer does it. <laughs> Look out, rat! Watch the pies! <laughs> Our pie, B2! Catch it, B1! <laughs> oh, good catch, B2! You too, B1! Not all of them, Lulu. Uh, good work, Bananas. Thanks to you, we have one pie left. And I think it's time we all had a little taste. Mmm, it looks delicious. I bet it tastes delicious too. <coughs> oh, yeah. oh, Bananas, what did you put in this? Apples. Can't you taste them? <laughs> we can only taste mud. Mud? It's not an apple pie, it's a mud pie. What sort of a trick is this, Bananas? It's no trick. There's been a pie mix-up, B2. A bad pie mix-up, B1. Don't worry, everybody. We'll run home and get the real pie. We won't be long. <laughs> no sign of our apple pie over here, B1. And no sign of our apple pie here, B2. Hmm, where did it go? Look. What is it, B1? A trail of apple pie crumbs. And it's leading away from our house. You mean our apple pie ran away? Either that or it's been pie-napped. Pie-napped? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Detective Bananas time. I've still got this trail in my sights, B2. Me too, B1. <laughs> Detective Banana 2. What is it, Detective Banana 1? I think I've found something. What? The trail of crumbs ends here. At Pedro's pen. Hello, Bananas. <laughs> Pedro? Why aren't you at Topsy's Shake and Bake party? I was, uh, too shy to go. Shy? Why? Because I'm the one who ate your pie. You? I'm sorry, but it smelled so delicious. I just couldn't stop. And so you swapped it for a mud pie? Yes. Now I've spoiled the shake and bake party. All because I ate your apple pie. Couldn't you have just made another one? My legs are too short to reach the apples up in the tree. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's apple picking time. Thanks, Bananas. Oh, you've made it so easy to pick these apples. Always happy to help. Right, B1? Right, B2. 
Bananas, you're back! Did you find the apple pie? We did better than that, Lulu. We found Pedro! Wow! Pedro! That's the biggest pie I've ever seen! The bananas helped me make it. It's for everyone to share. How simply scrumptious. Oh, let me go and get the plates. I'll put it on the table. Pedro, look out! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Good catch, B2. Sorry, bananas. No problem, Pedro. Now, who's for a slice of apple pie? Hooray! Hooray!